Hey guys, it's Greta here, Ladies Relationship Coach. And today's topic for you ladies is, can you date a guy who still has strong feelings for his ex? And let's see, who has been dumped by an ex? So, my short answer would be, yes, you can as long as you stay high value. <laughs> as most of you probably guessed my answer. So let me share actually two stories with you girls um, kind of briefly on how like my girls met the guys who had very strong feelings for the exes and now these both girls are in a very 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 happy relationship with these guys okay. So the first story that I wanted to share is um, the guy was dumped by a ex-girlfriend who he really, really loved. And then he met my client two weeks later. And my client was high value from day one, okay? So she was doing things right from day one and really like the guy was trying to get over that girl and he was really, really liking my client. So he kept on, she kept on doing things right. After three months time, he really fell for her and you know, now they're in a happy relationship for four years. He like keeps proposing to her, but she's like still considering it. But what happened was when she was being high value, and he was pursuing her, chasing her, treating her really well, even though he was still getting over his ex-girlfriend, right? Then he fell for my client when the ex-girlfriend suddenly appears and goes like, oh, you like her now? I want you back and I can have you back, right? This is what girls do. Not, not high value girls do, right? So what she did, she started pursuing him, asking him back, chasing him, and actually he did went to meet up with that girl after about three months of dating my client. And he saw that girl and like 10, 15 minutes later, he basically ran back to my client going like, no, I realized that I really love you now and I don't have any feelings for her anymore. And, you know, he was just so much deeper into my client, into the girl, because she was high value. And where the, where the ex went wrong was she started pursuing him like crazy after three months of basically him not running after her because he was busy and dating my client. So the story here is, yes, you, yes, he can get over an ex, and fall in love with you if you are behaving high value. And to be high value is letting a guy pursue you, controlling your emotions, also enjoying the moment, being fun, being lighthearted, you know, putting yourself first, putting um, your hobbies, your ambitions first, not letting a man walking all over you and stuff like that. The other story was as well, um, so it started a bit on a wrong foot. My client wasn't high value first. She did lots of things wrong. Actually, the story started with a one night stand, but then she met me later and I was like, okay, let's stop this. And we're doing this, 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 that, right? And then the guy that she was kind of seeing on and off, you know, he had very strong feelings for an ex as well. He was actually taking therapy, you know, going to a therapist to get over that girl. So um, when I started coaching that girl, even though she started doing things wrong from the start, when I started coaching her, she really picked things up and just started doing things right, like nailing, nailing, nailing everything, you know, as being high value. And that guy like literally fell for her like totally crazy like five months later. But with this girl it took much longer because she did uh, things wrong at the start and then we had to fix it and you know for her to get her value and respect back and then to come out on top. So it took much much longer. But at the end of the day, again, the guy really, really fell for her. And now we are in an incredible relationship. And again, 
once you start ignoring an ex, even though she is the one who left you, they always come back and they're like, oh, I can still have you. It's like, I don't know, what is it for girls and for guys as well. It's something like, if you cannot have him, you want him more, you know? So, but this is kind of such like low value behavior. So then um, that girl, my second client and that guy were having a good relationship. The ex comes back and she's like sending all these long emails. I want you back. You're the best. I miss you and all of that. And the guy just was reading these long emails and going like, oh my God, she just put me off so much. She's acting like a total, total doormat. I'm not interested in that. I love you. Okay. So here is my answer. Yes. Um, be open to date guys who just came out of relationships, but you have to do things high value and then there is a big, big possibility that things, you know, will go really well and you will have your happy ending. So if you liked this video, please press like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Join my Facebook group, which is called High Value Women. It's really, really good. I coach girls about how to be high value. So I do my uh, Facebook lives and um, there's other girls who are making comments and helping each other out. So it's a really, really cool group. Also join me on my Instagram. I do a lot of Instagram lives and um, I answer your questions during Instagram lives and yeah. And if you want one-on-one -on -one coaching, get in touch. And thank you so much for watching. And I hope you liked this video. And have an awesome day. Kisses from London. Mwah.